First, we will recap of our previous class. In our previous class, we were discussing about the properties of addition, commutative property, associative property, additive, additive identity property. We have discussed. Today, we will discuss sub, uh, our subtopic is subtraction and properties of subtraction. At the end of this class, the student will be able to illustrate the properties of subtraction. Subtraction without regrouping. In this, we do not need to take borrow any number. This type of subtraction we have done in our junior classes. You have to stop your video over here. Try to solve all these sums. Then we have subtraction with regrouping. In this type of, re, uh, of subtraction, we have to, sometimes we have to uh, borrow number from the previous number. Like we have 61 and 17. We cannot minus 7 from 1. So what we have to do, we have to take borrow from 6 when we take borrow from 6 it will be 5 and 1 will be 11 and when we subtract 7 from 11 we will get 4 and then we have 1 minus 5 we get 4 same here are some sums stop your video over here and try to complete these sums now we have properties of subtraction. These properties are just opposite of the properties of addition. In this first we have order of differences. The difference between two numbers is not the same when the order of the number are switched. Like in addition when we switch the numbers we get the same answer but in subtraction we will not get the same answer like if we are talking 5 plus 2 is equal to 7, 2 plus 5 is equal to 7. But if we subtract 5 minus 2 is equal to 3. And if we do 2 minus 5, it will be minus 3. Means the answer is wrong or different. Number 2. Grouping of term in a subtraction. The difference is not the same when different terms are grouped together in subtraction when we talk about the addition we uh, in uh, in grouping three or more numbers when we add three or more numbers we get the same answer but if we are talking about subtraction we get sorry different answers like we have 20 minus 5 is 15 minus 4 it will be 11 but if we have 20 minus or group may 5 minus 4 what we will do 5 minus 4 is 1 and 20 minus 1 is 19 so answer I got 19 it means they are not same zero property of subtraction addition we have to add whatever we have to zero se add karte hai, chahe, uh, 0 plus 5 or 5 plus 0 so we answer wo number milta hai, jisko mein hum zero ko add karte but if we minus the number of numbers with 0, if we minus the number of numbers with 0, like 7 minus 0, then we will get 7, but we cannot subtract any number from 0. If we subtract any number from 0, we will get answer in minus. Then we have number of zero we will get answer in minus i hope you understand thank you allah hafiz